okay, these two natives are driving back from the big city, and uh, they're heading to their uh, to their res, the reservation. If you're in the states, reservation. If you're in Canada, it's the reserve. Anyway, they're uh, still a few kilometers away from uh, from the res, or if you're in the states, a few miles away from the res. And they're both kind of hungry. And they drive by this farmer's field, and you see this pig out in the middle of it. So they both stop, and they get an idea. Mm, should we? I'm kind of in the mood for bacon and ham, pork chops. So they talk themselves into it, and they go run into the field, and they take the pig, throw it in the back of their pickup truck, but they don't notice that the farmer was watching them from his house. So the farmer he calls up the uh, calls up the RCMP, the Royal Canadian Mounted Police. Um, and they're driving. They're at the top of the hill. They're about to go down, down the hill into the valley to their uh, to their res. And they notice at the bottom of the hill uh, these two uh, these two police cars. The RCs are down there, and they set up a roadblock. So the two natives they're wondering, oh, what are they going to do? So they get an idea. Aha! I know what we're going to do. So they take the pig, put it in the front seat between the two. They take one of their bandanas. They take it off. And they tie it around the pig into a nice uh, into a nice bonnet. And then they drive down, and uh, they get stopped by the RCs. And the RCs uh, they look inside the uh, the truck. They say, okay, you two can go. So the two drive off. Whew, oh, we made it through that. And the one RCMP <clears throat> says to the other, "Hmm." Imagine that. I wonder how that happens. How those two ugly Indians could get such a good looking white woman with them.